Hey guys, this is my 2024 What's in My Hockey Bag video. Let's get started. Uh, we'll start with sticks. So, I have three sticks. The first one is Bauer Vapor X3.7, uh, P88 87 Flex, and it actually has my blade protector because for summer roller hockey, this is my stick. Because it's like my third stick, it's like the backup to the backup stick. I never really use it. And it's 87 flex. I can't shoot with it. I'm 150 pounds. There's no power in any of those shots. Um, my backup stick is the Bauer Vapor 3X. And honestly, I love this stick. P88 77 flex. I had it for like five months. Actually, it's nice. I like it. It has a lot of whip on it, which is actually really nice for uh, like longer range shots. But I really like it. But then after that, this came out. Bauer Vapor Hyper Light 2. Uh, P92, 65 flex. And this stick is... This stick is unreal. Like... It, 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 oh my god. It, like This stick... The release is crazy. You get so much whip on it. Like my shot went to another level with this stick. Like I, this is my favorite stick out right now. My favorite stick of all time is the Bauer Vapor. Oh, what? Oh, the Bauer Vapor X600. That was my second ever stick. I love that stick. That stick is crazy. I have it downstairs, but. Unfortunately, it's broken. So, yeah, that's awesome. Um, we'll start in the bag now. We'll go skates first. These are Bauer Vapor 3X. I got these six, six months ago. Um, I really like these. They're very light. Um, they feel very good. They're actually very easy to break in compared to other skates I've had so that was nice but I really like these the one thing I will say is that this thing oh it's not that one this thing on the back breaks very fast on these I don't know if that's with every skate but on the two pairs of skates I've had before this it has not done that We'll kind of go out of order. These are my practice socks. Nothing special. They're just black wool socks. And everyone actually hates on wool socks. They're not that bad. Very, very underrated. This is my jock. Just simple Bauer Vapor jock. Like, yeah. These are the pants. These are the CCM Super Tech, not 9550s. Um, I like these pants. They're very lightweight. They, they, you can move really good in them. The one thing I don't like is that this thing, like this thing to tighten it, gets twisted a lot, and it's very hard to untwist. And it happens a lot. And then... To go along with it, this is my shell. I play for the Queen City Royals. So if you don't know a shell, it just goes over the pants. It has the team logo there, and then it has like sponsors. So like we're sponsored by Adidas, all of our jersey socks, everything is Adidas. These, I wouldn't say new, kind of new. I got them like five months ago. They're the Bauer Vapor 3X Pros. I really like these, but the one thing, actually the two things I don't like, is that this part in the front, it's very thick. Like, you can't really see it here, but it's a lot thicker in person, and it just feels very bulky, and it kind of makes it heavier. Another thing, like this isn't, this isn't anything bad about the shoulder pads. It's like kind of just bad for me. I just got these mics, 
and I have like a few more but I'm trying to start doing a mic'd up video and the only part for me to put the mic is in here and this part moves around a lot like it like scoots around and stuff so the mic actually falls off a lot so when I get hit the mic just flies out so it's kind of annoying but we're gonna work we're, we're gonna find some we're gonna find a way to do a mic up because I'll mic down I want to do a mic up um these are probably newest to the collection they're the warrior LX20 I, I don't really know I just I literally went into the pro shop and I had I had really small CCM super tech shin pads before and I couldn't get any like ton tuck, tongue tuck. So I literally said I want good uh, shin pads that are, are big enough to go over my tongue so I can have good stuff. And he gave me these. And honestly, for like 80 bucks, I like them. They're lightweight and they look big, but they don't feel that big on. They kind of look big on, but they don't feel big, which is nice. And then mouth guard. You're like you're supposed to wear wear them. No one wears them. I do sometimes. Like if we're playing, if we're playing like a contact team or like a team that hits a lot, I'll wear it because like I don't want to get hurt. I'm I'm five foot ten, a hundred fifty pounds. And I'm going to play eighteen U hockey next season. I'm not the biggest player. I get hurt a lot. <laughs> uh, anyways, this is my helmet. And there's like nothing special. I actually don't really like this helmet. I've had this helmet for two and a half years. And I don't even know what it's the Bauer IMS 5.0. I don't like it. The this like padding inside is so like it's so thick and it's so like sh like hard. Like you can't like there's like no like squeeze or anything in it. It hurts your head so much. Um, there's your number on the front, team stickers, you have logo, logo, and then number on the back. Um, I have a Bauer Oreo cage, and before this, I had the Bauer Concept 3 Fishbowl, and I'm a Blackhawks fan, so I actually got it because of Bedard in the World Junior, so I put that on, and then when I got back, when I went to the Royals, I, I don't know, I just didn't like the fishbowl anymore, so I bought an Oreo cage. But the fishbowl is nice. I might sell it, though, because it was 90 bucks and I've never used it anymore. Um. Anyways, these are the elbow pads. They're the CCM SuperTech 9550s, just like the pants. Um. I don't like these because I don't like any elbow pad. So, any elbow pad I'll ever review, I'm going to say I don't like. Cause I like I just don't like any elbow pad. I think they're uncomfortable. I'm like I don't know. I just don't like them. Funny story, actually. One practice I didn't wear them because I thought they didn't do anything. I was like, I was telling all my teammates, "Oh, they're so stupid. Like they don't do anything. Like you never get hit in your elbow." I did one practice without them, got hit in the elbow. So that sucked, but it was actually kind of funny. And then. Actually, I take what I said about the shin guards. These are newest to the collection. I got these when I joined the Royals. Um, I actually got these really nice gloves when I was playing for the Falcons last year. It was like three months before the season ended. They were these really nice red and black gloves. And then I made the Royals, and I had to get black and white gloves. So these are the Bauer Supreme 3S Pros. And honestly, these are my favorite gloves I've ever had. Like, they're so lightweight. They're so comfortable. They're very padded. So if you get hit in your hand, you're not going to feel it. They're, they're really nice. I really like these. They're also very easy to break in, which is not normal for gloves because they usually take so long to break in, which is very annoying. And then this is my tape bag. And here I just have... Clear tape, white tape, black tape. I actually do have flame tape. Yeah. Never use it. Well, actually, I do for street hockey sometimes. And then in here, I have scissors, grip tape. Everything is going to fall out. Scissors, grip tape, wax, uh, puck for puck marks.
Also, I don't keep extra laces in my bag, and all my teammates make fun of me for it. Like, I've had, I've had one lace break in my hockey career. Like, I don't think you need to. Anyways, um, I got these for Christmas. They're custom sweat towels, and they have, like, the hockey pucks. Or they have the hockey sticks and the puck on the bottom. I have two of those. They're really dirty because I clean my skate blades after I'm on the ice with them. Um, all right, jerseys now. So this is my practice jersey, or this is one of my practice jerseys. Just black CCM jersey, Royals logo on the front, nothing on the back. This is my other practice jersey. Just gray jersey. CCM jersey, Royals logo on the front, nothing on the back. And then I play house league at our rank two with some of my teammates. So we're supposed to get the practice jerseys, but we get our numbers on the back too. I never, the, you get a black and a yellow one. My yellow one, I ordered it, never came in. So they gave me this jersey. It's an extra large jersey, nothing on it. I literally have to full tuck my jersey because they never ordered me my jersey. I paid for it, never got it. It was so ridiculous. So that jersey does not fit me at all. It's actually so funny. And then this is my black one. It's like the same as my other Brax jersey, CCM jersey, Royals logo on the front. Got my number on the back, 89. And then this is my high school jersey this summer. They actually it stopped recording because my iPhone storage is full. So we got to finish this video fast. But they never ordered us our jersey, so we got the beer league draft jerseys. And so our team, Team Purple, got the draft. We got the beer logo on the front. And then number eight, yeah, yeah, one goal, one assist in two games, yeah. Then we got, these are our royal socks. These are our home socks, just, yeah, pretty cool. Literally copied the Golden Knights. And then, oh, these are the away ones. Oh, my God. Same thing, just white. Uh, tryout jersey, just a white and black Royals jersey. 36 on the back. Another pair of practice socks. I don't use these, though, because they're too small. And then a net guard, which we have to wear now. And actually, everyone has to wear them starting... August 1st this year. And then garment bag with the jerseys. Has my name and number there. So this is the home jersey. Royals logo on the front and then name and number on the back. And then white jersey with the away one logo on the front. Name and number on the back. I'm number 89 because I was 91, and then one of my teammates picked 91 before I picked my number, so 89 was my tryout number, and I made the Royals for the first time, so I kept 89, and I kind of liked it, but, uh, and then the bag, just a CCM bag with the Royals logo, just the team bag, everyone on the team has one, um, but yeah, that's going to be it for the video, hope you guys enjoyed. Um, like and subscribe and there will hopefully actually no not hopefully there will be more hockey videos soon